Smurtis, she was a seamstress for a dry cleaners. She did that for a living. And she was just an excellent seamstress. Uh, she said that she did gowns. There was nothing that Murtis couldn't fix. She did a lot of the fancier kind of work that most never do. Most might sew, but they won't do big alterations and she'd tear it apart and put it back together. So she's quite a seamstress. I actually have just done crafts with her, which she'll sew. She'll sew just about anything. This afternoon when we're done sometime today, we're supposed to hem her pants. So she's gonna do that. I don't do a lot for her. I set up the sewing machine. Now at one time she had to tell me because I would set the sewing machine on very low like the lowest speed it would go, and she informed me right then and there that she needed it going very fast because that's what she was used to. So now I put it on very fast for her, and that's where she's happy at. Every now and then I might have to, to say that if you want to turn it, leave the, the needle in the fabric. Other than that, Murtis is going to do her own thing. I am very grateful that I was able to take the Artist of Dementia class because we see things differently than most would normally see it. I do things differently. Good Samaritan Center at Advent Christian Village regularly conducts training in the art of dementia care. Staff members working with those suffering from dementia learn to change their thinking from a medical focus to developing relationships with each individual, building a bridge into their world. The training shows how to ensure that not just physical needs are met, but that emotional, social, psychological, and spiritual needs are addressed as well, and in a way that honors each person under their care. Those who complete the course are affectionately called Artists of Dementia Care. The way we've helped many of our residents as an artist of dementia is we relate to their home life. We try to set it up as their home life. We sew, because they were great sewers. We bake, we cook. Um, we do a lot of stuff that pertains to their home life. Sewing is also a good therapy for them. It's very therapeutic and it helps them to relax. The program has taught me many things. It's taught me different ways to help them because it's so hard for them to adjust. At times they have a very hard time adjusting. So. There's a book called The Artist of Dementia, and that's what the class was based on. And it has helped me a lot. It even has helped me many a times because there's even a part that focuses on the family. I was a person that never, I focused more on the resident totally and never really thought so much about the family members and what all the traumas that they go through. So when I took that class, it actually helped me to see their aspect of it, and it truly changed me a lot. My name is Sandra Jordan. I'm a CNA and quality of life, and I'm also an artist of dementia.